We're here at Fantasia Gardens Mini Golf to play some mini golf. You're gonna lose your ball this time? I sure hope not. We'll find out. Who do you think is gonna be the first to get a hole in one? Me. Not if you lose your ball. <laughs> First things first, let's talk about the parking situation. Honestly, I've kind of avoided coming here for a while because I didn't know what the parking situation was. If you didn't know, Fantasia Gardens is located at the Swan Reserve. And typically when you park at the Swan or Dolphin or Swan Reserve, you have to pay for parking. And that does not include our inter annual pass. So I was worried that we would have to pay. But if you are here for mini golf specifically you do get a three hour parking pass with validation basically you get a little parking receipt ticket so basically you get this when you go through the gate to park then when you check in for your tea time they'll give you a sticker so they basically we'll just scan this when we go to leave that way we don't have to pay for parking so it works out great Plus they also had reserved spots like right up at the front. So you don't yeah. have to park at the back of the parking lot and walk all the way up here. So I did, it is pretty nice. I did like that a lot. If you are someone that's maybe staying on property though and you don't have your own car, honestly, probably the easiest way to get here is to, if you're from one of the parks, you can easily just take a bus to the Swan Reserve. Or if you're maybe staying near Epcot or something like that, you can honestly just get to Epcot and then just walk over. It is a little bit of a walk. It's not super, super close, but it is still walkable. I would say probably like Mark Allen said, the easiest would be if you're coming from a park, go ahead and take a bus to the Swan Reserve. Or if you are coming from Disney Springs, like or like coming from your resort, go to Disney Springs and then you can transfer to a Swan Reserve bus from there. I totally forgot to look at pricing when we were up there, so I'll make sure I have a card with the pricing information but we with our annual pass have the water park and sports option attached you can also get this option attached to your park ticket like as a regular park ticket so if you're like doing the water park and sports option because you're doing the water parks you also get entrances to the mini golf courses. The only caveat with these is that if you are using like those or your vouchers that you get with staying at a Disney resort, you have to use those before 4 p.m. So if you are planning on mini golf, just make sure you plan ahead of time. You at least have to be checked in. So right now for us, when we arrived, they said it was gonna be about a 30 minute wait because we did walk up. Yeah, and we got here on 2.30, so. But I did confirm and ask and I was like, so if it were a long wait like that, and it was like right before four, like as long as we're checked in by four, it can Counts, right and she said yes so that's great if you are coming after 4 p.m. or you don't have a water park and sports option ticket then you can just pay like normal something I really appreciate is that while you wait they have all these picnic tables with lots of shade that you can relax and hang out they had some fun like connect four like big connect four so if you have kiddos you can kind of play with that but you do have this nice little place to relax while you wait for your tea time right behind me is of course the main entrance here at Fantasia Gardens right smack in the middle is where you'll go to check in with your annual pass if you have that added on or of course just pay regular admission on this side of the check-in counter you have bathrooms and a couple of water fountains and on this side you have a nice little room thing situation where they have some air conditioning of course and some uh, snacks and refreshments things like that as well as a pressed penny machine and even some merchandise that you can purchase there are two courses that you can choose from you've got the gardens course which is the one that we're doing today that one is the one that has kind of your more like fantasia theming your like characters and statues things like that you also have the fairway course. This one's gonna be kind of more your standard mini golf course. That's not gonna have as much theming to it. When you are coming and doing a round, you can only choose one course at a time. So like if you're wanting to do both courses, you have to pay for both courses. Same thing if you're using your water park and sports option, you can only do one of these courses per day or per like redemption. If you have a water park and sports option with your park ticket, and let's say you have a three day ticket so you have three redemptions you could use one of those for a water park and then you could use two those other two redemptions for each of the courses so while we wait for our tea time i just want to talk about how much nicer this golf course already is and we haven't even like stepped foot on the course this seems a lot nicer than 
uh, Winter Summerland. The theming of Winter Summerland is very fun, and we have a video that we've done, mm -hmm. so we'll link link that video at, of winter summerland in the description below but honestly like just the amenities here i'm i'm really impressed this with one already. feels like a classy mini golf course i just uh need my uh my like members only jacket and i've only i've already seen uh sorcerer mickey so um i'm pleased what i didn't tell you is on the press penny machine they have a sorcerer mickey penny i don't have a sorcerer mickey penny do we, I need need that. A, do we need to go get one? Yeah. While we wait? Right now. Okay. Let's see if it'll work. Take my dollar. It won't take my dollar. We'll try the press penny machine again later, but they called our name. That actually was bad. We waited like 15 minutes. I don't even think it was that long. I don't know. But we're at hole number one. I'm orange. The kind cast member at the counter when we picked up our club and ball said you have to read the songs to know how to play each hole. I see it. Let's go look at it. Kata and Fugue. Normally in D minor by Bach. Music nerd coming out. Our musical game has just begun and here comes treble. For everyone up to the top, the ball must run for any hope of a hole in one. I think it means you have to roll it up that, that little uh, instrument, right? Oh, I did not hit that nearly hard enough. Oops. Par three. Wee. Wee. I was so close. Boop. The notes upon the staff you see may seem quite lovely musically, but now as you begin to play, you'll see they may get in your way. Gotta hit it through, where's the hole? I don't know. Ready, go. We, oh. <laughs> that wasn't it. <laughs> wow. Good job. Hold on, hold on, I'm gonna go again. You're at two. Oh. Good job. Three. Takata in Fugue, hole three, par three. Before our little fugue concludes, the music swells and changes mood. Avoid the rests, and you will hear chimes, a ringing sweet and clear. Oh, avoid the chimes. Avoid the How? chimes. How? Okay. No, avoid the rests. There's no rests. We'll find out. My ball. Oh, you're right, it was. Whoops. Rude. It was just what happens when you pick my favorite color ball. Since when is orange your favorite color? Why are you so good at this? Okay, now we're moving on to a new song. We've got the Nutcracker Suite. Spring is here and just beyond, blossoms float upon the pond. The open bud should be your goal. Its dainty petals surround the hole. Oh, I'm like actually the worst at this. These lively mushrooms circle round while one is hopping up and down. At the feet of Little Hop Low is where you want the ball to go. This one is adorable. Oh my God, look at that. Uh -huh. Come on, get in that hole. <laughs> I did it, I got a hole in one, I win. And so this musical suite we close amidst the flurry of winter snows, weather the storm where snowflakes fall or easily putt around them all. Going right down the middle through all the flurries. Do it. <laughs> Made it through. How do we look? Not too far from the hole. All right, let's see if Kayla makes it through. She did it. All right, I'll hit the right ball this time. Two. 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 
Who's winning? I think I am. Boo. Oh. See, the mountain agrees with me. Doesn't... Doesn't the scorekeeper always win anyway? Within Mount Olympus, the opus unfolds in what mythology, mytholo mythological? Oh, God. And what mythological creatures it holds. When putting the ball, be careful to go straight through the pillars to the caverns below. Secret tunnel. I want to meet the poet that wrote all these uh, things. Come on, baby. Oh. Come on, come on, come on. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Where's an earthquake when I need one? In all of the land, there's no more, there's no one more route, route, Ruck, uh, route. Ru ruckus? I have no idea what that word uh, is or means. Rambunctious. Then the fellow here, the infamous, I don't know what that word is either. Bacchus. I He's, think it's Rackus and Bacchus. Sure, we'll go with that. He's poured you a path that you simply put up, hit it just right, and it spills to the cup. Oh, oh, dang. Oh. Oh, no. <laughs> that was not good. Ba, ba, ba. That was not good. Starting a new hole, or new song, Dance of the Hours. You will notice in a glance these graceful ladies love to dance. This bird ballet is lovely, but they may distract you as you putt. Don't look at the ladies, Mark Allen. They're naked. Shield your eyes. Wow, that sun is hot. No. Oh no. Oh, oh no. PSA. It's about 2.40 right now, so it is kind of the hottest part of the day, but make sure you bring a water bottle with you because it is very hot and a lot of this is very much in the sun thankfully they do have some umbrellas kind of around the course so you can find shade but it's definitely really hot so be careful <laughs> this is mark allen's sixth putt can he make it nope Nope, he can't. Come on, come on. Oh, oh. Seven. Good job. This hole looks like a ton of fun. They were splashing. We saw the thing splashing a minute ago. Mickey's in trouble for casting a spell meant to assist him in filling the well. Now armies of brooms with a water supply are ready to douse anything that goes by. Oh, look. The music is actually da. Da 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 Time for the best hole, the Sorcerer Apprentice. When Mickey is dreaming, he's brave and he's brash, conducting the stars and creating a splash. From high on a cliff, he's on top of it all. He'll show you his stuff when you're putting the ball. Here we go. It's the best hole, my favorite hole. Sorcerer Mickey. Oh. <laughs> nope. 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 There we go. Oh, 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 oh. Woohoo! Good job. It's the last hole. It's the last hole. Thank God. It's hot. <laughs> This one looks cool, it's swirly. I think we're gonna lose our ball, so you gotta make it a good one. The Sorcerer's Apprentice, hole 18. The wave has grown bigger with magic it stirs. When up from the bottom, a whirlpool, whirlpool occurs. A putt to the left, we'll spin it, and then we hope you'll return here again and again. Last hole. That didn't rhyme. And then again, it kinda rhymes. 
right in. Wee! Wow! Round and round and goodbye! The end! This is why they have the blessed air conditioned tiny room. So we're trying the penny again. I think. I think it's down because the thing says unable to accept cards. Nope. Is it broken? I think it's broken. Dang. Guess. Guess that just means we'll have to come back. No sorcerer, makey penny for me. Okay. Two. Time to tally up the score. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, thirteen, sixteen. 41, 42, 43, That's 44, 45. Three hours later. I won by one, one point. Boom shakalaka. It's cause I got a hole in one. It is. You were the only one that got a hole in one. I was so close. 45 to 44. There was a couple holes that uh, we, we didn't count. That was fun. I liked that golf course a lot. I would probably come a little earlier in the day next time just because those last few holes were very bright and sun, and then the clouds went away, so it got very hot. It was a really fun course. I liked it a lot. Yeah, yeah the theming is really fun. I would say definitely if you're if you're staying at Swan or Dolphin or Swan Reserve, definitely I, it's literally right here, like walking distance. And keep in mind, if you are staying at a Disney-owned resort, you do get what's called um, magical extras. You have to book your tickets and your resort together as a package in order to get this, but you'll see a little like, essentially a voucher will pop up in your My Disney Experience app under tickets that'll say like one round of free mini golf. So definitely take advantage because you can use that either here or at Winter Summerland. Very fun, great for a resort day or just like a little break from the parks or whatever. I, I definitely would recommend not coming in the middle of the day like we did because it it's yeah. quite warm. Luckily it does go pretty fast and there yeah. are there are some shady spots. But overall we had a really fun time so we hope you guys had a fun time following along. Make sure you subscribe for more Disney fun. And if you made it to this point in the video leave us one of the four golf emojis. There's like little putters and then the putting green thing, the flag, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> But that's all we have for you guys today. Now, now go, go create, create your, your ever, ever after. Okay, so first we scan the little QR code. Do you? No, I think you just Yeah, that's what she said. Oh. Okay, so then it gives you the option for credit card or validation. We're gonna hit validation. Please scan validation. Ouch. The car is really hot. Okay, easy enough. What?